afternoon and welcome to the Wallace Branch Library Teen Craft Class. My name is Sandra and today we're going to do a glow-in-the-dark Mickey Mouse stepping stone. I got the idea from a young lady that works at Lowe. If you want to know how to do this craft, just you material you'll need is some mortar mix, some water, some glow-in-the-dark paint, a, char a character pan, A stirring spoon, a mixing bowl, some gloves, and a mask. Let's get started. The first thing is safety. Make sure you have your mask on because the mortar mix create a whole lot of dust. Make sure you have your gloves on because the mortar mix have little pieces of glass in it. So make sure you have your mask on and make sure you have your gloves on. Let's get started. My cup is a 10.2 ounce cup. And I'm going to put three of these inside the bowl. The slower you put the mortar mix into the pan, the less dust you will create. So slowly put the mortar mix into the pan. No dust. The slower you pour it in, the less dust. This is cup three. Okay. Next, I'm gonna put about half of this water into the water mix, and then I'm gonna stir it up. Holding water in really, really slow as well because it could create dust too. Now, if you put too much water, just add some more water mix. If you put not enough water, just add some more water. So let's slowly stir the water mix. Slowly. As long as you got the dust, make sure you stir it in slowly. Once you get the dry part stirred in, you can go ahead and stir it a little bit more briefly. Okay, that was not enough water. So I'm gonna add some more water. And you just add water until you get it to the consistency that you want it to be. Not too soupy and not too firm. This is how much water I got left. Slowly stir it because we got still got dust. Once we get it stirred and get it wet, get the mortar mix wet, we can take the mask off. just a little bit more water inside of it and make it a little bit more loose. Not much. So, I've used almost, I guess I got about a little over a fourth left in the bottle. So, you just stir it until it gets as loose as you want it to be. As you can see at this point now, there's not very much dust. There is no dust at all right now. Because I got all of the mortar mix wet. And it's at the consistency that I like. It's okay if yours is a little bit looser. And it's okay if yours is a little bit stiff, stiffer. So, let's get our pan prepped. Okay, I 
took my pan and I sprayed it with some cooking spray. So you can use some Vaseline, some baby oil, some cooking oil. You can use some, uh, just anything to lubricate it. So I'm going to go ahead and put my mixture into my, into my bowl. So let's get started. Okay, this is what it looked like. This is what mine's turned out to look like. So let's get started painting it. Okay, here is my finished Mickey Mouse. I painted him in the Disney colors and I use acrylic paint and I trimmed him in the glow in the dark acrylic paint. This is what he looked like with the light on and this is what he looked like with the light off. I hope you enjoy your Disney stepping stone. Have a great afternoon.